My project is called uh, Determining the Structure and Function of Heavy Metal Pumping Proteins. I do protein crystallography, which involves first molecular biology, because you obviously have to get your protein out first. We usually do that either by purifying it from some natural source, or we do it by making transgenic bacteria which express the protein. Afterwards, you need to know a bit of chemistry to crystallize your protein. And to solve your structure, you need to know some uh, physics and some statistics. The research we do is considered to be quite difficult research in uh, scientific terms, but uh, since we have the resources, we're one of those few labs in the world that can do it. Show how good the Thai cubes are. <laughs> <laughs> My colleagues are really great people. My lab is um, half international, half Danish. So you can really feel this uh, multicultural environment. Outside the lab it's great and inside the lab it's uh, very collaborative. So if you have any questions then uh, you just come up to them. They uh, help you experimentally sometimes if uh, you need it and if they have the expertise. My work is usually evaluated by presentations, which uh, we do uh, on a regular basis in front of uh, our research group. That's why I like mine. From a professional point of view, I think that uh, this is a really good place to get a PhD, at least in my case, because uh, our lab tends to publish in uh, very high-profile journals quite often and that is essential for you as a scientist if you want to get a good career after your PhD.